What is going on today, guys? This is Tony from Team Divine Pro here. Coming at you with a Madoka, Puella Madoka Magica deck profile. Now, um, this one's not really something you'd probably see, but it did top a recent, like, big event in Japan. And I was actually quite amazed when I saw it. So, um, it's really budget. It takes, like, one trial deck, because literally me and Matt from Team Divine Pro, we looked at it and we're like, whoa, this only takes, like, the one trial deck and then some other cards. Like, it, they're not even hard cards to get. So... I'll just go into the deck profile because it, it is good and it's budget and it's like it's actually quite good. So we played through uh, two of these Homura's Homura Akemi 3 2. Uh, it was quite funny. At first, when we started playing the game, Matt thought that Encore was like just stand again, like in Vanguard, just like continuous standing if you got, if you could pay it off. It's like, oh my. So we thought it was OP like that, but it, we found out after that Encore is different. And then we play uh, three Madoka Kanabe. Uh, that's it for the level 3s, so 5 level 3s. For level 2s, we play 1 Homura, uh, what is it, Fighting Spirit Homura, Fighting Against Fate Homura, good card, can't say anything more, can't say anything less. Uh, you play 2 Ally of Justice Sayaka. Now, the cards that you have seen that aren't sleeved are most likely cards that I do not know the effects of, but they are probably good in the fact that they were in the uh, video. Uh, they they were in the winning deck profile. And then you play one uh, Common Wishes Sayaka and Kyoko. So, as you can see so far, most of this is just trial deck stuff. Like, I think, if I'm right, I haven't hit a, re a really... Yeah, I think I've hit only trial deck cards. Yeah, it's only trial. It's only been trial deck cards. That's crazy. So like, you can get a really good deck. Okay, now, yeah, trial deck cards. Okay, so then, then after we played two Sayaka, I believe, just I don't know the name, two two Sayakas. These are good cards. They're accelerates. They have good stuff. Oh, I guess I play one more Ally of Justice Sayaka. I just missed that, so it's supposed to be three. So in total, you should have that. So one, three, one, two. So that would make. Two, three, six, seven, seven level twos. One green, six blue. Then for level ones, we play quite a few, I think. Oh yeah, quite a few, decent a few, man. So we play two five fives, five five uh, vanilla beaters. One battle with Wal Walpurn, I guess. I don't remember that name from the anime. Homura. Oh, Valpurgis Knot. Yeah, there you go. Valpurgis Knot. Uh, four five body one zero. Don't know what it does. Uh, but then this card's actually pretty good with the uh, link card it has. But that's in a different thing, and we don't play it because it's Kyoko, and it's it, it pretty hard to get sometimes. Uh, then, but it's still five five vanilla. And then we play three uh, one one two K block. And then we play. I think these are the level multipliers. I don't remember, but it's 1-1. One, one. I think it, it's something that you put in the back row. It's pretty good. Uh, it's, this one's called Smiling Sayaka. Then for level Z, uh, that was 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That was 12 level 1s. Then for level 0s, we play... Holy... Okay, so for level zeros, we play three of the Sayaka, zero, zero, two, five. Uh, then we play three, uh, uh, no, sorry, that was Madoka. This is Sayaka, uh, 3K vanilla bodies. And then we play four of these um, two, five, zero, zero, I uh, can't remember the names, the violin guy. Uh, he's an okay card. I actually read the ability. It's like check the top card and like put it at bottom. Or I think it's just leave it at the top. I'm not sure, but it's it's not as amazing amazing as a. Uh, I'm, I'm, my mind's drawing a blank. The girl from uh, Guilty Crown that I use all the time to check the top card. She's not as good as that. It's not as good as that. Then we play three uh three K body uh Sai uh Homura. Then we play two Mami, which is actually pretty good because it's the booster of the deck. Then, for events, we play three of the Searching Guards. 
Searching is good, I hear. Hand advantage is good. Consistency is good. Uh, then we play, I believe this could be swapped for climaxes. I think that this might be a different card. I think all you need is a gold bar, but since we had this, we can we played it. But in reality, you can be, pretty much use any gold bar, I think, as long as it has the same effect as this one. Then we play two, one uh, plus two soul, everything. Then we play the girl from the dream climax, four of them. It's, I think that this one, oh, it's a stock one, and put one in the stock and then put, uh, give one soul. Oh, my bad. You play actually two of these, two souls, and then one more gold brick. So I think that this one, these two have different effects, but anyways, there's eight. So yeah, guys, uh, give this deck a try. It's actually okay as a deck. I think we have used it, but it's been a while since I can't remember the effects. This is Matt's deck. Uh, it has been a while since we've used Madoka, but it's still budgeting. It's still pretty good, seeing as it did top a recent event while... The de while Dizagaya was out and everything, so it's pretty amazing. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please thumbs it up, like, favorite, subscribe to this channel. It really does help out, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. This has been Tony from Team Divine Pro, signing off.